Hello, Dr. Bowers, it's Sheldon Cooper. I need you to administer more anesthesia to me. No, I don't have a dental problem. I need to re-enter a trance-like state so I can communicate with Thoth, the god of knowledge. I would argue that the greatest discovery of physics is worth losing your dental license. Well, it's not my fault you let them publish your home phone number. If I was going to recapture my insight into a unified field theory, I needed to find a way to put myself back into an altered state of consciousness. Native Americans would sit in sweat lodges for hours to achieve this. I lasted a minute and a half. Self-hypnosis is another means of bringing stillness to the mind. When it isn't giving you a heart attack, the whirling dervishes of Central Asia employ a repetitive spinning technique to achieve a trance-like state. <laughs> After my other attempts to return to the trance-like state of anesthesia failed, I turned to something Nancy Reagan herself told me to just say no to. My mind-altering substance of choice was chamomile tea. But not your grandma's chamomile tea, a highly concentrated super chamomile of my own making. All the relaxing power of 30 cups of chamomile tea packed into a teaspoon of calming sludge. Sorry, Mrs. Reagan. Okay, Grand Unified Field Theory. Here I come. This isn't working. I disagree. Seems to be working fine and dandy. Mr. Einstein, I'm very excited to talk to you, but I was hoping to hear from Thoth, the Egyptian god of knowledge, so he could teach me the Grand Unified Field Theory again. Oh, the Grand Unified Field Theory, well, god da. He told it to me in a dream, but I can't remember. All right. Hang on, where is the fun in finding things out if some joker with a bird head just tells you the answer? But a grand unified field theory would explain the universe. Answers are all well and good, but a real scientist loves the thrill of the chase. Am I right, Hawkin? I would agree. I do also enjoy the thrill of rolling over bubble wrap with my chair. It, it is fun to pop that stuff, isn't it? So fun. But what if I never figure it out? I never did, and my scientific clay has nothing to sneeze at. Same here. Agreed. Uh, uh, don't, don't look at me. I, I drive a Hugo. So none of you can help me? I believe I can. Sheldon, if I was offered a choice between all the knowledge of the universe or the endless pursuit of it, I would choose the pursuit. That's very insightful. Hold it, hold it. He didn't come up with that. He stole it from Godhold Lessing. Who's, who's Godhold Lessing? He's an 18th century German philosopher. Now, do you mind? We girls are trying to have some fun over here. Apologies. Sorry, Cindy Lauper. Our bad. I, I like fun. While I made my peace with not having the solution to a unified field theory, my intestines did not make peace with concentrated chamomile syrup. Oh dear. Bathroom emergency! Bathroom emergency! 